a.m. folks welcome back to another episode of Bobby Guy Films and today we are going to go out and attack the public marshes yet again it is uh, today's Sunday the uh, still the opening weekend of big ducks here in the early zone in Kansas and uh, let me tell you what yesterday it was a war zone but we shot quite a few ducks. But today it's only three of us. It's going to be Brad, Wade, and myself. And it should be a good time. Yesterday there was four of us. Today three of us. I don't know if I'm going to use the big camera as much first thing in the morning. I'll probably have to just because the low light is so much better and the video turns out so much better in those early, early morning low light shots. That camera right there just it is 54 degrees, getting a little bit cooler. Feels good outside, can't wait till it gets down in the 30s. But we are on our way. I will see you guys at the marsh. interesting start to the day I have forgot my waiters in my truck at Wade's house so <clears throat> this is uh, how we are gonna roll today should be quite interesting should be pretty chilly it's only about 50 degrees out here 52 degrees yes the temperature went down a little bit since we last checked it but we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna march out there try to stay warm might have to do some jogging techniques get the blood flowing but uh you can see how this goes oh yes yes feet are completely soaked we made it we found us a really nice I don't know if you guys can see that at all but it is a really nice little open hole perfect perfect uh, we didn't even bring any any decoys we just brought two mojos from what the birds were doing yesterday they're not decoying completely they're just skimming over the top kind of reacting to your uh, to your motion so we brought two mojos and that is it so this is the no waiters no decoy uh, duck hunting challenge you know doing doing it redneck out here there's three right here swinging in here Come on, come on. Rough going today. Oh, four is pissed. He needs a duck, Dad. Stop leaving them hanging, man. There might be one coming from the west. Oh, got him. Nice. I thought it was all reached around backwards. Touch him up. Touch him up. Oh, man. Oh, two of them. Nice shooting, okay. boys. Man, that went way out there. <laughs> He's still trying to lose some weight. Boy, buddy. Look at that big group. Brad, get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Oh, man. And they had to bust them.
they see them, obviously. Good God. They're over us, but everybody and their dog sees them, so they're going to call at them. You might as well. Watch. You guys just start squawking over here at them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See what I tell you. 200 feet in the air. Oh, yeah. The little birds that we have here, people are just sky busting the, the hell out of them. 200 foot freaking shots. At least let them try to decoy, you know. But public land, this is how it goes. This is the second day of opening weekend of Big Ducks. And uh, this marsh is just big enough to where yesterday was the opening day. And it just got blown to smother smothering. So it is, uh, the ducks have checked out. They're either all dead or they're just in New Mexico by now. So we're going to wait it out a little bit. Maybe go get some early breakfast. Oh, yeah. Lovely. Lovely. That was a great idea of me forgetting the old waiters. But this was a uh, short little public hunt. This thing, like I said earlier, it just got blown to smithereens yesterday. This being the second day of uh, opening Big Duck Weekend, it got murdered. If you guys haven't, check out all of our new paracord items. We got the new little fella lanyards and the freedom, the camo, and the money lanyard uh, colors that you guys seen before. And we have new game totes all ready to go as well as gun straps. So we got all the new freaking hot paracord items ready for you on the website. Link is in the description. I want to thank you guys for watching. Like this video. If you did, we'll come back and find some new public areas to go hunt. We tried a little different today. We didn't bring any floater decoys. We just, we brought two mojos. We we're like, you know what? They're not decoying. They're just going to end up buzzing us and burning over the top of us and shooting them on the go. So didn't waste the time bringing out the decoys. I'm glad we didn't. So have a good one. Y'all subscribe if you haven't. Peace. Yeah. Guala, 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 guala. I'm living like it's no tomorrow. Don't know my style, won't let you borrow. You're thirsty, have a glass of water. I'm killing these beasts, I'll be more dead. I'll put my.